The fears of MPs who walked out when the 7 trillion shillings 2010-2011 budget was hurriedly passed by a handful of legislators have now come to pass. Led by Nandala Mafavi, the lawmakers walked out when the budget was being considered two weeks ago on the grounds that very little time had been allocated to scrutinize in detail what was being appropriated to the different public sectors. The legislators warned then that this could give the Minister of Finance a new way to change figures at will in the process, providing a major loophole for the abuse of public funds. This morning, the Budget and Finance Committees discovered there were serious discrepancies in the Appropriations Bill after the Finance Ministry changed the figures passed by Parliament. But now looking at the Appropriation Bill, we have found that the figures that had been passed by the Budget don't tally with the figures that have finance. You don't have to agree, excuse the committee, and then go to engage in a ping pong after, after, after members have pronounced themselves on that. That, that would be uh, trying to hijack the role of members of parliament because appropriation is purely a function of parliament. For instance, the six billion shillings allocated to the Auditor General's office were not indicated, although the money had been approved, while Phoenix Logistics was still given 1.5 billion shillings, despite the objections of parliament. And we are sticking by our positions. We must support the office of the Auditor General to be independent, to carry out its mandate, to reduce fraud. Phoenix had become a bottomless pit indeed. You just put in money, it never gets filled. And nothing we have seen. So we said there should be no money for Phoenix. The money we gave them is enough. Let them first account for the money. And specifically it was for capitalization. To increase our share capital to 79%. But the House rejected it. Now the finance minister said that Bomba has been summoned to explain why what was appropriated does not match what has been allocated. The anomalies were discovered as the two committees made the final touches on the appropriations bill before it is taken before the whole house for approval. Agnes Nandutu, NTV Tonight.